Good morning, everybody. Today is the 8th of January, and I am having some breakfast, and then I'm going to head out. Um, this is how I'm starting my day. It's about mm, 8 o'clock, I think. I'm really not sure. Um, yeah, so I'm going to head on out here a little bit. I'm going to go to Sam's. I'm thinking about going to BJ's, too, because they got the cat treats there that are four big bags for, like, 12 bucks, so... I might head down that way too. Um, just want to say good morning. I will, uh, when I get into the car, I will um, have a little chat with you. And um, I'll see you in a bit. Alrighty, Bye. good morning. We're on our way to the park for a walk. But I just wanted to see oh, the air just feels so good. I got the windows down. It was 32 this morning. I love it. So crispy, crispy, crispy. I don't know if you can see me from the sun or not. Um, Yes, I'm going to the park to go for a walk, and then I'm going to go to Sam's, and then I'm going to go to BJ's, or go to BJ's and Sam's, and, uh, yeah, just get out of the house for a little bit, peace and quiet, too much ruckus going on up there, Ugh. um, yeah, I did really good yesterday, I have done really good since the first of the year, and I'm so proud of myself, and I see everybody else is doing really well. good thing. Yeah, my mom's going to go for a walk around the neighborhood today. It was awful yesterday. I told, she, I, she doesn't want to go to Sam's or BJ, so I told her to walk around the neighborhood. You know, it's beautiful out. Turn that thing jingle. It's beautiful out, and um, a nice walk will do you good. Probably all are shaking. I'm not going to hold you on here very long. I just wanted to let you know that um, I'm walking, I'm going to do for a walk, probably another, I think it's 45 minutes if I go around three times. Maybe I'll do an hour and go around four times. We'll see how good I feel today. It's beautiful out. And, um, and then I'm going to head over to BJ's and um, they have cat treats. They sell cat treats, big, four big bags for like 12 bucks and that's so cheap. And uh, it's like getting a bag free. And um, yeah, and a few other things over there. They, it's a, I don't know, BJ's is like a Costco's or a Sam's, but I I do like them better. But they're they're about another, they're about 45 minutes away from here, so I'm already going halfway there to the park. So I figure I might as well go the other way and pick up a few things there. And I may even stop at Home Goods. It depends how well I feel. I should stay out of there. Have gone through it if that bicycle went in there because it would have been still yellow when I went through. And then I'm gonna go to Sam's and get my um, bulk supplies you know, paper towels, paper plates, things like that. I buy in bulk there, and uh, that's pretty much it for the day. Sunday, they're gonna my husband's working on my daughter's car. I guess they're going to smoke the ribs. I don't know. He's got an attitude today. He usually does after he parties. He's an asshole. But, uh, yeah, he is. But, um, fine, because I'm carrying on. So, um, really not that much to say. I hope everybody has a great Sunday afternoon. And I will see you later when I have something for lunch. If I have get anything interesting at Sam's or BJ's, you know, Weight Watchers wise or anything like that that I discover, I will definitely share it with you. But usually it's the basic stuff that everybody already knows about. It's already out there, and, you know. In my grocery hauls, I don't shop for like a week and we eat everything and we go back. I don't. I I, I shop very different. That's why I don't really do grocery hauls because I'm not. You know, it might be, you know, I may go shopping four or five times before I ever buy meat, you know, because then I'll see meat on sale and I'll buy, you know, I, that's how I buy, that's how I shop. I, we're trying to actually get out of doing it that way because I would like to shop for one week at a time or two weeks at a time, eat it, it's done and go, but I don't think it's in me. <laughs> I'm old school, I'm very old school and that's... You know, it comes from my grandmother, from my mother, I guess put on to me. 
Um, and we grew up very poor. And I know I'm not running out of food, and I don't, and I don't have an excessive amount. But like, if I want to make something, I got 99.9% .9 of the ingredients there. A lot of times, I'm stopping at the store because I have a few recipes I want to buy, and I just need a few items. So you know, and I buy things that are on sale, so you don't run out, and you don't, you're not paying a god wad of money for it. But that's me. That's a whole nother thing. Um, I'm gonna go. Y'all have a great day. And I two point four miles because it's point six all the way across. Oh. I'm going to sit and drink my water for a few minutes, and uh, beautiful walk, beautiful, I loved it, I went around four times, which makes it, because it's .6, so it's for 2.4, whew, I'm going to head on to BJ's and uh, rest for five minutes first, but I'll talk to you on the way. Hey everyone, I am back from shopping. I've been back for a while. I got back about 2.30, quarter to three. Oh, I am so tired. Do I look tired? The ribs were delicious, because I ate some when I got home. I wasn't going to, but once you took one bite, you were gonna eat them. I ate, uh, let's see. I ate probably half of this size here. Three, four ribs, I guess. I don't know what the point is. is. I was hungry. I did eat a chicken sandwich about 1 o'clock, I think it was. A grilled chicken sandwich from Wendy's, which I didn't realize was 9 points. I don't know why, but I don't know. So I don't know what all my damage is of today, because I had three for breakfast. And... See, I have a harder time on the weekend. That's why with my weeklies, when I was doing smart points, I would just have no weeklies left. I would only stick with my 30 points a day because um, I would do good, but it was hard. And I'm exercising more, so I know it's not going to make a big dent in it. I'm going to count 20 points for the ribs, 9 points for the grilled chicken sandwich, and 3 for the bacon I had this morning. So that's what, 29, 32. So 32, which I think I was down to 39, but that's okay because I can do good during the week. I do better during the week and then on the weekend. And I only have to four more days to go because I weigh on Friday and Friday is my free day. So, and I'm going to exercise too tomorrow. I have to pick up my mom's prescription. So I think I will um, see if she wants to go in the morning or not. But I'll go and pick up her prescription on the way back, and then I'm staying home. I've been running around. I'm tired. And get things organized. I'd like to start working on that room. I think I'm going to put my crafts down there. Yeah. I think that's the best thing to do. But, yes, and I, and I want to try to make my video about, because this, my channel is about changing or coaching my life journey. This is not only is the weight loss part of my journey, but um, empty nest is part of my journey. Um, getting myself healthy and happy is part of my journey. It's just that it's the first of the year and getting back on track and, and stuff. So I am going to do another video about the journey past the weight lost. Um, so stay tuned for that. I can do that during the week when my husband's not here. He'll be gone all, not this week, but the following week. So I get a lot better there too. And if I exercise tomorrow, I've already exercised four days. So I'm going to try to do it every day, especially after eating those ribs. But they were so good. They marinated for two days and they slow cook. You just pull the bone right out. I ate it without even any barbecue sauce. It was that good. And I, the quinoa salad's still in there, but that's good. I'll have that for lunch during the week with other stuff. And um, so that's not going to go to waste. I'm tired and I'm full. And I did have a yogurt, so oh, that's another two points for the um, fit yogurt. So that's another two points. At the end of, um, at the very end here, right in here somewhere, I will put how many weeklies I used today. <laughs> <coughs> and I was trying to be careful. 
But I am ending my vlog for the night because I'm tired and I am done for the night. I am done. It's going on 5 o'clock. Or, no, wait a minute. It's going on 5.30. 5.30, 6 o'clock. So, I'm done. I'm not hungry. I do have some fruit. I'm probably going to have some strawberries. And some watermelon. I think that's what we, because i got to eat that watermelon. Watermelons and strawberries is what I, and I'm really craving that. I'm craving that refreshingness of it from being out all day, which was beautiful today. Let me tell you, it was beautiful today. If I had done this in the summertime, you probably wouldn't even have gotten this far in the video because I would have been dead, drowned, rat. I would have been so humidified, dehydrated, it was beautiful out today, and my walk was beautiful. Everything was, oh, God, it was just beautiful. I, I'm very tired, but it's a good tired. <sighs> keep got to keep active, and i got to get my Fitbit going, because I would love to know how many steps I've taken today. <sighs> I might work on that. Maybe I'll do that tonight while I'm watching um, This Is Us. That's really good. I, I'm on the third show. like it so far. I heard a lot of good reviews about it, and uh, I thought, why not? Let's give it a whirl, and I really like it, so I'm going to be a fan of that. Um, yeah, so I am going to say good night this Sunday. I'm tired. Everybody, have a great Monday. I'm not a Monday person, but let's all have a great Monday, and um, I'll see you tomorrow.